Hello everyone, today we are at Jali Zhongxing. Um, it's quite a nice area in Shanghai. Lots of department stores and high-end luxury brands. For your reference, the Curry Center is located in Jing'an, one of the most posh areas in Shanghai. It's kind of like Ginza in Tokyo or the Upper East Side in New York. So we wanted to test our or everyone's English level and yeah. how important it is for the workplace or for social life in general. Yeah. Nice to meet you, Kevin. What's your name? Uh, Nick. You can just call me Nick. Cynthia. Cynthia. Yeah. Cynthia. I'm Alex. Nice to meet you, mate. Hi. It's uh, William. William. Yeah. Nice to meet you. Yeah. What's your name? Uh, I'm Chen. You can call me Chen. Oh, nice to meet you, Alex. This is this uh, Brian? Ah, uh, Jason. Jason, very yeah. good to meet you. Uh, I'm Mia. Hey. 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 Where are you from, Nick? I was born and raised in China, and um, I went to UK to study. Okay. And now I um, I work in Shanghai. You work in Shanghai? Right. Yeah. Wow. How would you rate your English from a scale of 1 to 10? Scale 1 to 10? Yes. Yeah. Probably 7. 7? Okay. Yeah. So you're still missing 3 points. What's, yeah. what's missing? Wow, vocabulary, very important. Vocabulary. <laughs> wow, but I can I can hear your conversational English is very good already. Right? Wow, thank you. Yeah. Um, no, I haven't I haven't spoken any English any English for a while. Actually, <laughs> I'm a little bit nervous. <laughs> <laughs> no, don't don't be. Don't uh, be. It's, it's already very good. I can hear UK accent. It sounds amazing. So, on a scale of one to ten, how would you rate your English level? With one being the worst? Uh, maybe five or six. Five or six? <laughs> what do you think you're lacking? The four uh, points or so? Maybe the uh, smoothly. Yeah. Because uh, although I've, I've been working in the uh, international company, mm -hmm. but a uh, few of the time, a few of the opportunity I could use English uh, yep. during the communication mm -hmm. because we are Chinese. I have to say, like, maybe eight. Eight, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Amazing. So the two points that are lacking, what do you think you're lacking in terms of English? Uh, pretty much Chinese parents, the way I've been grown up. Yep. Um, I was raised in the UK, so. Oh, there you I go. I was actually born there, but. There you but, go. You know, at home, you, you know, we, we mm -hmm. have to speak Cantonese. Yep. So yeah, that's why uh, I wouldn't say that I'm. I am native, but I'm not fully native. You know what I mean? Yeah, but at least you get the diversity. Yeah, definitely. You get Cantonese and English. Yeah, sure. I think it's an advantage. I think. Yeah. Scale one to ten, I'll say mm. maybe seven to eight. Seven to eight. Wow, yeah. this is pretty good. It's pretty good. <laughs> okay. Wow. Where are you from, by the way? Oh. <laughs> I'm from Taiwan. You're from Taiwan. Yeah. Okay. My friend is also from Taiwan. Oh really? Yeah. Hi. <laughs> How did you learn your English? Um, growing uh, up. Grow. I study maybe some uh, at bilingual school. I keep us in like bilingual environment so help you yes. to have <coughs> good pronunciation. Okay, okay. And for the two points that you're missing, so eight out of ten, what do you think you can do to improve? I guess it's the um, opportunity to speak English in the workplace. Work. In Shanghai at the moment? Or? Uh, yes, I'm currently working in Shanghai. Yeah, what kind of industry are you in? Uh, I'm a software engineer. On a scale of one to ten, how would you rate your English level? Uh, I think it's only five. Five? Yes, because uh, some daily uh, mm -hmm. communication, I think it's okay. But for some mm -hmm. high level uh, yeah. communication, I don't think I, I will have a good dialogue with yeah. someone else. Yeah. Okay, so you think you lack the speaking part of English or maybe the grammar? Uh, I can speak it, but yeah. I, I'm not sure the grandma is okay for my dialogue. Yeah. Yeah, I reckon you can get a seven and eight easy. Uh, okay. yes, yeah, uh, yeah. maybe. <laughs> yeah. And how did you learn English growing up? Because I think your speaking fluency is quite good. I think above the average. Uh, because I graduated in Australia. <laughs> really? Yes, okay. from my postgraduate. I don't know if you can hear, but we're from Australia as well. <laughs> well my accent is Australian, so oh, I don't know really? if you can tell. Yeah. Oh, nice. Where, yeah. did you, where did you study in Australia? Sydney or? Uh, Melbourne. Melbourne, okay. Yes. There you go. Yes, I graduated in the University of Melbourne. Oh, you need yeah. Melbourne. There yeah. you go. Fellow Australians. <laughs> Shanghai. I can tell your English is it's pretty good. How did you learn English growing up? Uh, actually, my major in the university is uh, business English. It's business English? Yes. Wow. Amazing. Yeah. And on a scale of 1 to 10, how would you rate your English level? Probably 7. 7? <laughs> okay. So still 3 points lacking. What, okay. what do you think you're missing? <laughs> oh, well, actually, just for, actually for my, my English level, I think it's um, just for daily communication, I think for uh -huh. some professional words or something like okay. that. It's still need to improve. Still need to improve. Yes. Yeah. Three or four. Three or four? Uh, yeah. What do you think you're lacking the most? Like speaking, uh, writing? Speaking, yeah. 
Yeah, a bit of vocab and stuff. Yeah, I, I can understand, but I'm not a good at her speaking. Yeah, there you go. Do you use English in your daily life at work? Or? Um, maybe 10 years ago, I will use a little yeah. bit of a lot. A little bit? Uh, at least, least 10 years now. Do you think uh, having good English is important here in Shanghai? Yeah, I think it's really important, to be honest, um, because in Shanghai, you can meet all the people from all around the world. Yes. And um, if you want to know more about their culture, you need to understand how to speak time, um, English yes. and um, to get a better communication. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And in terms of work, is there any... And in terms of work... In English? Um, well, it, it really depends. If you work for Chinese company, you don't really need to. You don't really have to. Um, but if you work for um, for obviously companies like um, Microsoft, Intel, Apple, mm -hmm. I guess you you have to um, improve your English skill. How did you kind of learn English growing up, from school to work? From Watch school. videos. Or? Yes, I have uh, sometimes to uh, will in the YouTube or. Yes. Oh, uh, Billy Billy, they will yep. have some. <laughs> yeah, some bloggers, Bojo. Yeah, yes, yeah. blogs. Yeah. yeah. Like that. Do you think English level is important in Shanghai? Yes, of course, because there are so many foreign, foreign, mm -hmm. foreigners in Shanghai and yep. some overseas companies in Shanghai. So, yep. uh, based my understanding, mm -hmm. uh, many people want to join an uh, overseas company because exactly. they will have more annual leave and more flexible work, yep. working work time. Yes, balance. work life balance. So, yep. I think English is so important in Shanghai. Yeah, especially in Shanghai, such an yeah. international city. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Do you think <clears throat> knowing good English is important in Shanghai? Yeah, I think it's, yeah. <coughs> it's quite important, sorry. That's okay. Yeah, I think yeah. it's important. Why do you think it's important? <clears throat> to communicate with you know, uh, more international people. Okay. And you have more opportunity to work in different environments. Do you think having good English is important in China? So far, I think uh, yes. I think for the person who are uh, working in on top companies, and you have to because uh -huh. you have to communicate with the overseas customers. Overseas. So Do you think it's important to have English in Shanghai? It's uh, good to have this mm -hmm. skill in Shanghai, but yeah. uh, I think it's also okay if I don't speak it well. Uh, for nowadays, yeah. we can use lots of apps to communicate. Yeah. Because, yeah. Oh, it, and of course, you guys also can speak in, in Chinese. In Chinese, exactly. Yes. There you go. Oh, sorry. Uh, there's a call. Taxi is here? <laughs> yeah. Okay, amazing. No, all good, all good. Nice to meet you. Thank you. Thank you, Cynthia. Bye-bye. Thank you, Thank you.